Good afternoon, folks. Big Bo here with another great fifth wheel value from Parkway RV Center. We got a beauty to look at today, guys. One of the highest end uh, fifth wheels that Keystone makes. This is a 2019 Keystone Alpine. The model number is a 3701FL. Guys, this is 41 and a half feet long. Weighs 13,700 pounds. It is a four seasons with R40 insulation. This is definitely designed for the full timer. Five slides, front lounge, pretty much got anything and everything you could want in a fifth wheel and then some. So let's look around this guys. Take a look, see what you think. Of course, this is a full profile fifth wheel, which means this thing was built and designed with, side, with no weight restrictions or uh, size restrictions in mind besides what the DOT says. So in other words, it's a full profile, high roof, very heavy, very well built, designed for maximum comfort. Not for really a, not for really economy when towing it. It's got the six point hydraulic level up system, just like a class A motor home has. So you push a button to level it up. Man, this thing's a beauty guys. Local trade, got 50 amp electrical service. And I'm sure I'm gonna miss a lot of stuff when I go over it because this, this fifth wheel has so many features and options that there's no way I can memorize all of them. Not cheap, but when you look at other ones just like it and you pull up NADA, this thing's $10,000 under base NADA retail. Base NAD, NADA retail is $70,000. I've got it for 59.9 with a full warranty a full inspection and many other features you don't even get for at other dealers for the NADA retail price. Let's see. MSRP 91.8, low retail 58.4, average retail 70,350. And I don't do use NADA much guys, but you can see what I got on it. So this may be out of a lot of people's price range. Hey, I understand that. I got fifth wheel starting around 12.9 um, and everything in between, but this is probably the most expensive, nicest one I have on the lot right now. Let's look inside, guys. Uh, it does have dual power awnings, Fury and electronics, outside speakers. Wow, let's look inside. Of course, I got hooked into power right now. And you want to see a nice fifth wheel. Take a gander at this one. This thing is beautiful. Does have the, I don't know if you notice when we come up, it does have the solid step instead of the folding step. So you just, everything picks up inside. You don't have to worry about dragging anything. And it's a whole lot more stable to get in and out of. High rise roof with the LED lights, ceiling fans. We'll start here. We'll start up front. Why not? And again, guys, if I miss some stuff, I'm sorry. I'll try to show it to you best way I can. Uh, front lounge. I'm six foot four. I have no problem walking any part of this fifth wheel without hitting my head, even under lights and vents. It's got a 50 inch TV that is on a lift and of course you got a 40 inch wide fury and electric fireplace and you push the remote button your tv goes down you got a little 3d window right here in the front that's got one-way glass boom check that out guys uh, up here in the front, you've got all leather furniture. You've got Theater Thomas Payne by Lippard Components Theater Seating. These are the power theater seating. You can see the LED accent lights. These are heated and massaging uh, theater seating. So it doesn't make a bed, but it makes basically a double recliner. And then you've got two sleeper sofas um, across from each other. So you can sleep four people up here and plenty of storage. Furion electronic stereos, uh, Furion TV. So everything or Furion, depends on how you wanna how you wanna pronounce it. 
but anyway guys carpets original looks great poster is original looks great this camper has very very little use showing on it it does have two let's talk about the hvac system for a minute you do have two ducted 15,000 BTU Whisper Quiet Airs. One of the quietest RV air conditioner systems in the business. And it also has the 16,500 BTU electric um, heat pump, too. So you've actually got electric heat, you got gas heat. And then this fireplace right here is a 5,100 BTU electric heater that will heat this whole living room area and probably most of the kitchen up just by itself. And then you've got a 40,000 BTU propane furnace. So, you know, if you want a winter camp, guys, or stay in it or live in it in the wintertime, you've got no problems. This thing can handle any weather North America can throw at it, guys. R40 insulation. Looking to the middle kitchen area. Go ahead and lock the door so nobody comes in on us. Solid surface countertops, which are like Corian countertops. You've got a table and chairs with a leaf. You've got the nice lighting fixtures. I um, mean, crown molding, attention to detail. You look at the facade around the um, around the slide out. It looks great. Looks like they've added a few little personal touches the previous owners have. Look at this beautiful kitchen, guys. Man, this thing is a cook's kitchen. Three burner cast iron stove top. Uh, Furion microwave convection oven. And then you got your Furion um, oven down here too. Cool. Uh, you do have a residential uh, refrigerator and it does have a built-in inverter so you can actually get this refrigerator cold while you're towing your fifth wheel. And guys, this thing I believe is 22 cubic feet already cold with a, of course, French door with a bottom freezer. Man, this thing right here is, is going to take care of all your refrigerated needs. And uh, what's cool about it, no pun intended, <laughs> is um, in an hour, this thing's ready to put food in. Now, if you had an RV refrigerator this big, you'd, ha you'd have to wait about four to six hours before it was cold enough to put uh, food in it. Well, this one takes about an hour. And uh, very efficient as far as amperage goes. And like I said, you do have a built-in inverter to power that thing when you're driving down the road. Of course, when you're at the campground, you're hooked into shore power anyway. Um, double basin sink, got the sprayer, all that good stuff. Uh, looking over here, guys, you've got the touch panel, I believe 8-inch screen. And 0000 is the password. From here, you can put your awnings in and out. You can control... Uh, you can uh, you can move it up and down. You can level your coach, turn your lights on, water heater, water pump, check your battery status, and more. All right there. Let's walk toward the back, and it's got 200 square feet of outside storage underneath the bedroom. So that's why you have this step up right here, and I've got pictures in the in the ad itself. But walk up here to. The bed, oh, you know, for guys to forget something, guys. Like I said, this thing's got a lot of stuff. Look at this closet. Looks like a pantry, doesn't it? It's not. Look at this. A half bath. A bath and a half fifth wheel. A China RV toilet. This is that uh, same flooring um, that they put on pontoon boats. It's got a 25 year factory warranty. The floors in these Alpines. The vinyl anyway very sturdy even if it gets wet it's it's going to withstand uh swelling up and things like that because it's a fiberglass resin look up here or fiberglass a uh component instead of wood and vinyl look up here guys walk through bedroom queen island bed looks like there's room there to put a bigger mattress if you want to put a king if you don't mind it hanging over your bed frame just a couple of inches on each side uh, another TV up here Storage again got a privacy curtain plenty of duct work plenty of lighting And then you step back to one of the biggest bathrooms you'll find on any class RVs Is in this motorhome or this uh, fifth wheel right here guys Jack and Jill sink vanity area solid surface countertops 
big stand-up shower with a skylight uh, look here this ugly guy in the mirror and you can see how much I'm six foot four you can see how much space I have uh, fantastic vent fan got a, another RV toilet and of course the one thing everybody wants now this this washer and dryer I'm not as opposed to because this is actually a stack unit this makes more sense but since most RVs don't have room for a stack unit you have to use the one piece combo unit this right here guys you can actually wash and dry clothes a lot more efficiency efficiently because you can have one load in the washer one load in the dryer <clears throat> excuse me so um, it's got the stack washer and dryer so like I said, this is definitely a full-timer's RV, no doubt. And of course, that washer and dryer, right now, if you can find them, will cost you about $2,000 to quit in a fifth wheel that doesn't have one. This one's already got it, guys. Man, this thing is one beautiful fifth wheel. Priced way under NADA, way under market value. This is how we sell stuff, guys. This... This is a prime example of why we've been in business for 53 years is because of deals just like this right here, guys. <clears throat> now, I know this big fifth wheel is not for everybody. It's going to take a heck of a truck to tow this. If you don't know what your truck can tow, look in the video description below, and there will be a link to my free interactive tow guide. You can look up what your truck can tow. I would highly recommend, at minimum, a one-ton dually with a diesel motor. Of course, that's rated for the right tow capacity because 13,700 pounds is before you add water, food, luggage, and more. So you probably want to add 700 to 1,000 pounds to that uh, to figure out if your truck can tow it or not. <clears throat> but you can use my free interactive tow guide in the link in the video description below on YouTube. And it's also on my website. And you can... Uh, um, Click on that link, or you can go to my website directly if you don't trust links, uh, parkwayrvcenter.com, and put in your truck specifications. It will show you what your truck can tow, and you can push a button on the lower right-hand corner that shows you everything we have in stock that you can tow safely with your vehicle. And my tow guide also has a formula that adjusts for luggage, food, water, propane, things like I said earlier. It's got a formula depending on the size of the uh towable camper or towable fifth wheel how much weight to add for that stuff so it's a more accurate representation of what you can tow besides saying hey 13,700 pounds plus a thousand pounds for cargo so um something to look at and uh, i also have a link in the video description below to our four page inspection process as nice as this fifth wheel is guys and i am sure this thing is going to pass through that inspection process like a hot knife through butter just based on how well the previous owners kept it. Of course, you know, they spent $90,000 on this thing. I'd, I'd keep it up and keep it real nice too. But, um, and guys, keep in mind, that's not counting fees and our, everything else that the previous owners had to pay when they bought this brand new. It could have well been a lot more than MSRP um, because you don't know how to understand how the, how the new dealer's pricing models work. And I'll go over that more in a minute. But, Guys, this thing's $59.9, includes a four-page inspection process. There'll be a link in the video description to that. Um, that goes over everything on this coach, and you can look at it, guys. It's the most thorough in the business, and it will definitely surprise you. Um, no other dealer does that on used RVs, but that's why we've been in business for 53 years, guys. You don't stay in business for three generations like that if you don't treat your people right, sell your product for a good price, especially in all used market and um you know guys this is why we sell five six hundred used rvs a year I've, I've met people from all over the country that travel here every week to buy from us um it's it's incredible guys had some people from wisconsin um that were here yesterday that traded in a motor home for another motor home uh i met people from oregon last week uh people from florida um i mean it's nothing to have somebody come in here that, that drove several hours to come here and look at our inventory to buy something from us. It's because of our prices, our inventory, and the way we do business, guys. We don't... Now, if you want us to sugarcoat everything and and not tell you like it is, then, then this isn't the place for you. 
you know you need to go to these big corporate rv dealerships where they they sugarcoat everything make you feel good but at the end of the day you got ripped off here guys we tell it like it is we sell our stuff for a fair price and we treat you very fairly um but you got to understand guys we have way more buyers than we have inventory right now i mean we sold 17 units this week all used and guys you know we go through these things after purchase we do that four page inspection process if you want to know the current lead time for a for the inspection process ask your salesperson and they'll give you an estimate man this is a nice comfortable fifth wheel i'm gonna sit here and watch tv all day <laughs> And I don't, I'm not even a big TV fan in an in a, in a RV, but wow. This thing is nice, guys. It really is. Anyway, $59.9 is the price. And um, includes our four-page inspection process, which we go through and fix anything that we find that may not work, if anything at all. No additional cost to you. That's all built into the $59.9 price, as well as a 90-day Easy Care Nationwide Limited Warranty that you can extend very, very affordably if you're interested in that. And I do recommend that anybody wanting to full-time in one invest in an extended warranty, guys. And here's why. Good thing about Easy Care versus other aftermarket warranty service contract companies is they actually will pay any licensed repair facility to work on your fifth wheel for an approved claim. So here's the thing, guys. You're going to run into this when you're living in one. You know, you live in an RV. Things are going to break from time to time or malfunction. And that's just part of it, guys. It's man-made. It's imperfect. That's new or used. Good thing about Easy Care, you know, in normal, with most warranty companies, you'd have to call, make a claim. And you'd have to call a RV dealer that's in their approved network that can work on the camper. And most of the time, they might be backed up for weeks. So your camper, if you're living in it, you got to go get a hotel room or stay with friends or relatives or whatever for weeks while your camper sits unlooked at on their lot. And uh, massively inconvenient. Well, the good thing about an easy care warranty is they will pay any licensed repair facility to work on your camper. It doesn't have to be in a network, guys. You can be a new dealer, a used dealer, an independent shop, but most importantly, and this is for you full-timers, it will cover a licensed a mobile RV technician that will come to your campsite or property and fix it without having to put it in line somewhere and disrupt your life worse than it has to be. And uh, that's why I do recommend a extended warranty for those of you, if you can afford it for a permanent or full-time uh, RVer. But anyway, guys, if you're interested in this fifth wheel, pick up the phone, give us a call. 706-965-7929. I like the French doors separating the bedroom from the bathroom too. Um, this thing can sleep up to six people. We do offer nationwide delivery service and guys, all we ask you to do is just cover our expenses on delivery. It's free up to a hundred miles one way. And um, you know, and if it costs us X amount of dollars to take it to you, that's what we charge you. We don't make any profit on delivery. Uh, we keep things easy, simple, and done here, guys. We're not like the new dealers who charge you thousands of dollars in fees on top of the advertised price. We're not like new dealers that make you go ha uh, go through forced financing where they tell you, all right, to buy for the advertised price, you have to be approved through so-and-so bank, and they kick in a rebate uh, when you finance through them to, to put it toward the price to get you to that advertised price. Guys, that's a that's that's a scam. There's no rebate. Banks don't pay rebates to dealers for customers for doing a loan. What they're doing, guys, is since you're, they're do, they're dealing with the bank and not you, they're marking the interest rate up when they get you approved for an RV loan, sometimes 2% or more, which on this amount of money over the life of a long-term RV loan could cost you multiple thousands of dollars in higher payments, way more than you're getting from the rebate. And uh, what they're doing is they're just applying some of the profit the dealer made because the banks let the RV dealers keep about 75% of that profit. And um, they're just applying a portion of that to the sales price to make it feel like you won, but you haven't. And then they're going to tell you, uh, Mr. and Mrs. Customer, or either or whatever, um, you can, uh, you know, you have to buy a five-year extended warranty, which is marked up four or five times dealer cost. Ours is marked up 
Ours is marked up, I think, $100 just to cover the extra paperwork involved if you buy an extended warranty from us. You get the 90 day regardless if, if you buy it or not. But uh, they're going to say, well, Mr. Miss Customer, you got to pay $7,000 for this extended warranty and they'll, fire, and they'll kick in a rebate towards your sales price. The warranty company will. Nope, again, a lie. Warranty companies don't kick in rebates to dealers. They just let the dealers keep the, all the profit they make after dealer costs on the warranty. That's it. Then they're going to tell you, well, Mr. and Ms. Customer, you got to buy gap insurance to this company, which is marked up again, way over dealer cost, multiple times over dealer cost. And they'll say you got to buy this Cylon or exterior treatment package, interior, whatever. You get this extra warranty, but you're paying thousands of dollars for it. It's, it's a scam, guys. And that's how you go in, you buy a fifth wheel, that, like we'll use this one for example. You'll buy a fifth wheel advertised $59.9. You do everything they want you to do to buy it for that price. If you come in and want to pay cash for it, they charge you thousands of dollars more. Because you they obviously if you're paying cash, they can't apply those fake rebates to it. But you say you do everything they want you to do, you become a sheep and you buy it, do everything they want you to do, you call the bank the next day. Something that was priced for fifty nine nine, you owe uh, seventy five to eighty grand on. Don't think it can happen to you. Wrong. It happens to multiple people every day, and you're stuck in it. I mean, literally, you're you're stuck in it for years and years and years. So if it's not the one you want, or a year later you decide you want to do something different, you're stuck. You can't sell it. You owe more than way more than you can sell it for. You owe way more than you can get trade in for. All you can do is if you don't have the cash to pay it off or pay it down to where the payoff and the value is the same, you're screwed. I mean, no other way of really putting it to you. <laughs> and that's how these big dealers make their money. It's not always about what they charge up front, the sales price. It's about what they do to you after you buy the fifth wheel. And um, <clears throat> yeah, they might make five or $6,000 on the profit on the front end then they're making 10 to 15 on the back end and that's money out of your pocket so that's just a scam guys i like to warn people about when you buy from these big dealers especially the franchise dealers rip off world places like that guys they all do this that's how they make money you know guys we're old school we've been doing this 53 years we make our money on the front end the profit on the sales price that's it if you want to go through our finance department, whatever a rate the bank approves you for is what you pay. There's no interest rate markup. If you want to buy an extended warranty, it's a $100 markup to cover the paperwork. That's it. It's plus applicable sales tax, of course. And if you've got questions about that, when and where and how much tax you pay, which depends on how you're paying for it in the state you live in, ask your salesperson. There's no other fees, guys. That's it easy simple done it is a haggle free firm price because we don't know what we're going to spend when we do the inspection on it uh we don't you know we have to pay the hundreds of dollars for that warranty that 90 day warranty and then we also pay to uh preston my walkthrough expert to give you a full in uh, walkthrough demonstration you can record with your phone in fact you're encouraged to guys if you're a first time rv or please record your walkthrough you're only going to retain, and I'm not calling anybody dumb or anything like that, but the average person's only going to retain 40-50% of what has gone through because it can be an hour, hour and a half long demonstration. So you're not going to retain all that, nothing wrong with it. It's being human. So record it with your phone or camera, and then of course you can always call. We'll try to talk you through uh, some issues on the phone if you have any about hooking it up or using it. Oh, go with that. I hear a little thunder out there. It's supposed to have some bad storms here in a little bit, but I wanted to get this one on, guys. It's a beautiful fifth wheel. Um, like I said, I know it's not for everybody's budget. I understand that. It's, it's, it's a heck of a deal for somebody looking for this floor plan and in their budget. Um, but if you're wanting to spend less, look in the link in the video description below to my fifth wheel page on my website, parkwayrvcenter.com. I've got a huge selection of used fifth wheels various sizes various price ranges um you're gonna be impressed but thank you all again for watching feel free to smash me a thumbs up feel free to comment uh share on social media feel free to subscribe to my youtube channel hit the bell notification the more interaction you give my channels and my, my channel my videos 
the more YouTube likes to share them with other people in their algorithm. So please, please, please just, just feel free to interact any way you can. Uh, 706-965-7929 is our phone number. If you're coming a long distance away, please call. Leave it. You probably want to strongly consider. I recommend you leave a deposit. You don't have to, but I do recommend it. And, um, and of course, use your common sense and always call to make sure it's available and doesn't have a deposit on it before driving down here. Come out and look, guys. I got 100 plus used RVs in stock, a little bit of everything. Um, got some beautiful fifth wheels out here. I got travel trailers. I've got class A and C motor homes, gas and diesel. I've got toy haulers. I got a little bit of everything, guys, and everything's used. I haven't been able to get a new one in six months. I've got three lines I carry new, and I can't get a single bit of inventory. That's, <laughs> uh, you know what? That's the same problem everybody else is getting. That's why use has become so popular, guys, because honestly, that's about all you can get right now. And if you want to buy this thing new for $97,000, you probably couldn't because there's probably not any available without waiting months for one to come in on special order. But thank you for watching, guys. I appreciate it. Appreciate each and every one of you. And if you got any questions, call us, 706-965-7929. Uh, Email sales at parkwayrvcenter.com. Open Monday through Friday, 9 a.m. to 6 p.m. Eastern time, Saturday, 9 to 5 Eastern. Closed on Sunday. That's the Lord's Day and Family Day for our employees. We do not open up for any reason on Sunday. And we yes, we are closed most holidays. Um, but anyway, guys, thank you for watching. Look forward to seeing you here in beautiful Ringgold, Georgia.